First, though, a deadly crash involving a bicyclist. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us. I'm Bridget Ellison. And I'm Justin Mormuth. The fatal bicycle crash happened earlier this morning in Kissimmee. The scene was crowded with neighbors who thought the victim could have been a child at first. News 6's Ezzy Castro has more from the scene. Troopers say the crash happened just after 7 o'clock this morning. They told us that a man was riding his bicycle when he was struck and killed here on Buenaventura Boulevard. Sad, maybe sad situation. George Arroyo woke up to the news that a bicyclist was killed near his complex on Buenaventura Boulevard here in Kissimmee. My wife called me this morning. She was going to Publix and she told me there was a lot of police commotion here and that she saw the body back, you know, the body lying there with the yellow cop on it. According to FHP troopers, a 30 year old woman driving a black SUV struck the 82 year old man this morning. Neighbors here telling us off camera the crash was so loud, many rushed outside to see what was going on. Some even thought the victim was a child at first. Well, there's a lot of people who are, who are pedestrian. Then they, they don't have car. They, they cross here all the time. They, they should be careful more and they should, you know, put there should be more uh, signs. It should, should be more, uh, like I said, police presence here. We were there as traffic homicide investigators collected evidence while they kept the westbound lanes on Buenaventura Boulevard closed. As for the driver, troopers say she remained at the scene and was not hurt. So the cause of the crash is still unclear, but troopers say that this is an ongoing investigation. In Kissimmee, Ezzy Castro getting results, News 6.